Thank you, Madam President. First of all, I want to thank the High Representative for her work in the Arab world, as we describe it, but in particular for her interventions in Bahrain on behalf of those whose human rights have been violated and have been subjected to inhumane treatment and torture. And I welcome your statement today on the disgraceful treatment of doctors and medics in Bahrain. I think the total disregard for medical neutrality is just staggering. So many NGOs, Human Rights Watch, Doctors Without Borders, Physicians for Human Rights, all document numerous cases of torture in hospitals and medical centres in Bahrain. It's unacceptable anywhere, but I think it's doubly so in a medical facility. We have the national dialogue, but I, I think that's doomed to failure because of the composition of those in the group that are conducting this dialogue. But the recent initiative by King uh, Hamad on the Independent Investigative Commission might offer some possibilities. But as you said earlier, I think we need to call and continue to call on the Bahraini government to end the unlawful detention and to ensure the human rights of all their citizens.